Hey guys, welcome back to the channel here. Just gonna do a quick little video uh, of the power box. I had a couple, couple people wondering where we was at on it and what it looked like, what we got going on. So this is gonna be a quick little video on just the features and where we're at on it. So let's get started with this. So right off the bat, uh, got two banana jack plugs one on each side one of these is going to be uh, for solar power input to the solar charger inside of this guy and this one over here is just going to be a constant 12 volt dc uh, if you look up top here we have a digital volts dc gauge we have a usb we're going to have another usb and we're going to have a 12 volt SIG lighter, cigarette lighter, that's going to have some adapters where I can convert this to uh, USB or whatever. Uh, not, I'm not going to be using this power box for power tools, anything. This is just strictly for camping, fishing, charging phones, charging iPads. Um, you know, stuff like that. Over here on this side, we have two Eagle Eye lights. Over here on this side, I'm gonna put a, probably main power switch here on this side. This switch here, this switch is gonna control the unit up top here. And this switch is gonna be for the lights on the side. And let's open this guy up and show you what we got inside. We've done a little bit of wiring on it. And let's see here. Let me let's open this guy up here and see what we got. And inside of here, all we got right now is we have uh, put a little clips along the side here. That uh, this is the main battery compartment where the battery's going to sit. Got a black lead and red lead for the positive and negative. This is 12 gauge, which I'm not going to plan on. I'm not planning on doing anything more than 20 amps with this unit. So, going up to here, I do have the wiring for the two little Eagle Eye LED lights. I haven't got wired in yet. This is not done. This is just part one of the series here. Fuse block. Uh, this is the negative, positive. These are my circuits. It's a six six circuit uh, fuse block. It uses the, uh, the little auto fuses, whatever you call the straight blade, 12 volt DC auto fuses. Solar charger. Uh, this is the 30 amp. This lead here I just have hanging out for the time being. I didn't go ahead hooked up yet. Uh, this is double fused. I mean, it was it came with it. It will be fused here uh, with a 15 amp. I think that's a 15 amp fuse. That's going to the switch up top, as I showed you earlier, that runs these on these USBs on the top. And this one here is going to the constant. Going to the constant. Banana jack up on the top, and of course we're going to have the one going to the solar charger is going to be fused, and a negative, and a positive, and negative going to hit. So let's see here. That's part of what the inside looks like so far. We flip this guy back over. And we're gonna close him back up and let's show you what we got going on here. I try to do some of the wire. As you can see. There's the there's the switches. I don't I just have one. That red lead there is going to the uh coming from the battery. They're coming from the fuse box, my bad. And there's the banana jacks for the constant 12 volt. Then here's all the plugs for the USBs. This is going to the solar charger. So I can just close this up once I get my wiring done. 
And I want to try to put a uh, 50 amp air battery in this guy. I'm hoping that we can. But guys, that's where we're at right now. We still got some wiring to do. Uh, all that good stuff. I uh, gotta get a battery order. Don't have the battery ordered yet. I've been looking for some sizes and dimensions to fit in this guy. But this is gonna be uh, just a little power bank, power box to charge some phone, charge some iPads, run the uh, router, Wi-Fi, if the power goes out. Uh, have some lights, you know, for when the power goes out as well. But, yep. If you guys like the video, like, subscribe, comment. Let me know what you think. If you want to see some more videos, stay tuned. we got some coming up. Might take me a little bit. I've been trying to, I've been a busy guy. So just bear with me. But, uh, till next time, guys, we'll catch you on the next one.